Well, the Richland County Conservation Commission works to conserve land and preserve historical sites. When community members heard some of the commission's funding may be cut next year, they took action to get the county's attention. Here's Julia Kaufman. These white bows on historical markers around Richland County are to bring awareness to the work done by the Richland County Conservation Commission. The commission helps preserve buildings and install markers like these ones. The bows were tied on sites across the county by preservationist Catherine Fleming Bruce. It was a, a way for us to make sure that people could see some of the um, some of the resources that RCCC provides. Bruce has had preservation projects funded by the commission in the past. She started decorating historical sites they've worked on like the Alston House with bows after learning they may lose over $200,000 in annual funding. Without that funding, that wouldn't be there. Richland County's proposed budget for next year takes money away from the commission. That's why so many people spoke up and said, well, if it's if it's in trouble, we're here to say it's very important to us. 44 people spoke out against the budget cut during Richland County Council's most recent meeting. Vice Chair of the Commission, Buddy Atkins, says the support means a lot. We were very pleased that we had the phenomenal support, uh, you know, and the show of goodwill, you know, really for three decades worth of work in the county. Atkins says if the budget cut is approved, they'll have to take a big chunk out of their reserved fund, which is meant for other projects. Chair of Richland County Council Paul Livingston says the commission has had leftover money each year. That's why the proposal suggests reducing their funds. It just simply asked the um, Conservation Commission to take it from their $2.2 million general fund. So they'll still be able to do the project they plan to do and so forth. So it's not a cut as, as, as one believe it to be in, in terms of preventing them from doing what they really, really um, need to do. Council will vote on the budget this Thursday. In Columbia, Julia Kaufman, News 19, WLTX.